Dragon may breathe fire again at Dragon Point, one of Brevard County's favorite landmarks. Annie the Dragon, who overlooked the Indian River Lagoon, is likely to return. Let's just Dan Biller reports a buyer has been found for the property on which she sat. She sat. Dragon Point without a dragon doesn't look like much. The point is the far southern tip of Merritt Island, near Melbourne, and the old house on the property is so ramshackle it may as well be haunted. But back in the day, Annie the Dragon, a towering creature with a crooked smile and a green concrete skin, stood watch over the point. I've lived here about 25 years, and so I saw the dragon in its glory, and we were so disappointed when it fell down. That was in 2002, when storms battered the 30-year-old lizard to pieces. Along with it, the home on the property fell apart and stood abandoned for about 10 years. But the Carpenter Kessel home selling team at Dale Sorensen has found a buyer. Everybody knew where it was. Um, a lot of people wanted to walk the lot, but given the condition of it, we basically did all the marketing through video. The property was a little difficult to sell because realtors couldn't even take buyers on the property to see it. About the best place to see it from is right here, unless you've got a boat. The new owner is broadly hinting that he will not only build a new home here, but also a new dragon. I know that the owner has a strong interest in uh, exploring the option to rebuild it, and he's the perfect guy to do it. I hear there's rumors that fires to come out of the side or out of the mouth, so it should be fun. <laughs> dragon Point needs a dragon, bigger and better. <laughs> the new owner says he's anxious to get started. In Brevard County, Dan Billow, West 2 News.